What's good? What's good? What's good? First off, man, I'm going to um, spray some air fresh and some Febreze to get the Von Shui right. Get the Von Shui right, man. Um, Got to clear the air, get the Von Shui right, man. I'm just going to just be saying like, just like this. You've seen the title of the topic. First and foremost, it's your big homie, Big Bad A. It's the Real Talk Real Shit Podcast, man. Thank y'all so much for um, tuning in. If you haven't already, subscribe, man. I'm trying to get them things up. It's free to show support, man. Show your boys some support. Hit the subscribe button. When my video pops up, you ain't got to watch it every time. Just got down, hit the subscribe button. Hit the bell notifications. You know what I mean? So, boom. I wanted to ask a serious question to the females today, man. Um, And this video is not just for the females. It's for my fellas, too. But it's geared towards asking the females. Now, look. You seen the, the title of the video. Do y'all, do females... And I know the answer to this, but do females want a good man? Have females ever wanted a good man? Okay. You saying, yeah, you're saying, yeah, I do want a good man. Oh yeah. Yeah. I do want a good man. Now, first and foremost, what's a good man? <clears throat> a good man is somebody who's responsible, who's reliable who's honest as possible, honest as possible, trustworthy, um, dependable, somebody who's going to pay their bills, handle their business, conduct themselves, um, you know, accordingly. You know, somebody who's not going to disrespect people, step out of their way to hurt people, harm people, a good man. You know, somebody who would help help the uh, old lady grab something, somebody who helps somebody when they see them get hurt, when they fall. Don't laugh at people when they fall. Boom, 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 boom. That's a good man. I mean, that's just a brief example of a good man. Now, do women want a good man? Hell no. Fuck no. Let me say that again. There's no, no. Women don't want no good man. Now, why do I say that? I'll say that because of this. I'm a good man, right? I, I don't have a PhD on uh, women. But I am a ladies' man. I am um I am a man, you know. I I'm very good with women. I know how to conversate. I'm very good with people. I know how to conversate. I know what needs to be said when it needs to be said. I, I consider myself and care about people. You know what I'm saying? I know I'm a good man. I know um I I've I've um I've I've done it all. I've done it all from have housewife to have Women, multiple girlfriends. I done done it all. You know, I've done it all. I know I've walked it and I talked it. You know, so when I say that a woman don't want a good man, it's like this. <laughs> Even back in when you was in school, right? Why did all the uh, bad dudes get the girls? I'm going to tell you why. The dudes, the quote unquote bad guys... And I won't even call him necessarily a bad guy. I call him the real man, the um, the alpha man, the ogre, the Neanderthal. You know what I'm saying? Cause I'm an alpha male. You know what I'm saying? I just consider it. I'm a cancer, so I have that compassionate shit in me. You know what I mean? So anyway, when you when we was in school, when I was in school, the only nigga who got girls, the only man who got females, was the one who was telling the jokes, the one who was. Picking on people, the one who was, uh, you never necessarily have to fight or do no stuff like that. But if you got into a fight and you kicked somebody's ass, you had girls. Um, yo, the 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 tough guy got the girls. The dude who made everybody get their attention. That's the key. For all my nerds out there, for all my nerds out there or insecure men who don't know the right things to say and when to say it to a woman. All you really got to do if you uh, want the woman you want, you got to make her laugh. You got to make her feel comfortable with you. And you got to make kind of like a fool out of yourself in a sense. Oh, no, 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 no. In a sense that um, not make a fool out of yourself, but make her comfortable with you. You got to show your your size. You know what I'm saying? You can't just be all, look, you think you're going to get a girl. This is for my nerds. You think you're going to get a girl sitting in class like this? And you ain't doing nothing, but got there listening to the teacher 
And and I'm not saying nobody be bad in school because it ain't even school time. School is everybody at the house doing school. It ain't even like that no more. I'm just simply saying, when you think or do you think if you were in the in this book in the school with the book and the pad, goddamn doing your thing, listening to Miss Mary or Mister whoever, and Buddy back in the back throwing spitballs and shit, and got the girls in the back laughing and giggling, he got the girls. Your ass ain't even noticed. She didn't even know your last name. She just know your first name or whatever because you keep passing her pencils or some shit. Do you understand what I'm saying? And look, another thing lame niggas do, another thing the nerd does, he'll do some shit like bump into the girl he likes and, oh, excuse me. Bitch, now you looking like a weirdo. Or he'll, um, she'll drop some, oh, here's your book. Here, 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 here. <laughs> just trying to suck up or just do any little corny little thing to be noticed other than saying, damn, girl, you look good. I've been seeing you for like, since we've been in the class, boom, boom, boom. Hey, we should hang out at the class sometime. You know, I, I don't know what you into, but I do this, I do that. Boom, 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 boom. Now you got a fucking chance. You know what I'm saying? Um, The nice guy, I'm going to tell you what's going to happen to the nice guy. You play that nice guy role, or you be the real nice guy, genuine nice guy, because I'm a nice guy. I'm the good guy, to be honest with you. I'm an alpha male, but let me just tell you how I, where I, my shit switched. I've always been hard, harder on women, right? As far as, no, baby, 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 baby. I ain't do all that shit. I never did that shit, because I was always just a, a decently attractive looking man, you know, but I'm kind of handsome, so... I never really had to, oh, baby, baby, mm, I never had to do all that shit, you know what I'm saying, to get a woman. I tell her what I, what I is on my mind, my heart, and, and we go from there. So, boom. Growing up, I was kind of, like, egotistical a little bit, like, where I knew I had value. So, and that's the fucked up thing about good-looking people. Good-looking men and women, it's a deadly thing when you look good because then you put a higher value or society. People put a higher value on you than 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 you actually are because we're all humans we all just have different attributes some this some that i might look good but i might not be shit she might not look good but she might be very intelligent she might be business oriented um money savvy all that kind of stuff everybody have pros and cons there is no one group of people that you should just say fuck that because to be honest with you i like uglier girls because ugly girls treat you good pretty girls treat you like pretty girls think everybody want them and everybody does so they're out there seeking attention and they're looking for attention and affirmation all the time and keeping their antenna up like because they think somebody want them or they want somebody to want them. So pretty girls really ain't what you want. You really need you a good, get you a good seven and a half, eight, six and a half, seven, eight out of the scale of 10 and sit your ass down because all that 10, you think you want that 10. You think you want that, that bad bitch. You think you want the bad bitch. And I've been dealing with beautiful women all my life. I want to say bad bitches out because I want to disrespect females I've been with. But you think you want a beautiful model-esque type of woman? No, the fuck you don't. Because everybody want her. And, every, and somebody done got her. Because I'm going to tell you, if you got enough niggas knocking at your door, somebody you're going to let somebody in. And that's just how the game goes. So when it comes to being a good man, don't be out here, baby, baby, baby. Yeah, I do whatever. Uh, and I'm gonna tell you another thing. <clears throat> you desperate niggas, you desperate niggas are fucking the game up for everybody. Y'all pussy ass, desperate ass, bitch ass, non communicating ass niggas is fucking up the world. You know why? Because y'all pay for women. Y'all got them. I'm gonna wallet it. I ain't gonna wallet on me. Y'all pull out, uh, here's $50, here's $100. Here's two hundred dollars, baby. Here, do something nice for yourself. Sometimes you might pay for the pussy. Sometimes you might not. Sometimes you just pay for companionship. See, y'all niggas is lame. Y'all fucking the game up. But there's a place for y'all too. You know, y'all are tricks and Johns and all that. But at the same time, you don't want to ever put yourself in that box because look, even if you're a millionaire, for all you rappers, for all my famous people, this to all my famous people, if you're a millionaire, right? And you go to get a bad bitch, like a Ari Fletcher or a thick ass, high quality woman that everybody goes for nowadays. The high demand, the high demand chick. If you got that bitch, 
You're going to be buying a Birkin bag, Louis, Fendi, Prada, Gucci, Prada, 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 and all of that shit. And dropping all your goddamn dollars. And praying to God she's going to follow. But she ain't going to follow. She's just going to swallow the next nigga with the biggest dollar. You know what I'm saying? So it ain't never really what you think it is, bro. So you need to be a man. All men, young or old, don't matter, teenager to a grown 100-year-old. You have to be a man. And I'm going to tell you why I went wrong with my uh, prior relationship, where I went wrong. When I first got with my prior relation, my ex, I was hard on it. Like, a little bit, not, I didn't care as much. Put it like this, I didn't know, <laughs> I didn't know her, so I couldn't really just give her all, everything off the rip. You don't just give everybody your heart. That's another thing, too. When you meet somebody, you don't just give them everything. You don't just give, whip your stick out and just, you don't just open your legs up and let somebody hit it just because you feel like they like you. No, bitch. Because the time you give up that, your, um, the time you give up your most prized possession, your gateway to your soul, your vagina, the time you get that up, you ain't got nothing left to give. That's the most valuable thing you have. Men, the most valuable thing we have it it should be well men uh men are worth a little bit um less men are worth a little bit less than females as far as um cuz cuz dick is good but the game is so fucked up girls got fake plastic dick so dick's value is went down a whole lot you get what i'm saying the value of the of the dick has went down so much in these modern times cuz it's so many goddamn out here you know what i'm saying and um everything i'll just put it like this man the game is fucked up the game is fucked up so if you're a real man it's pretty much gonna be hard for you because nowadays for like the alpha males like a, a man like me i'm so stern and not even like Argh. but i'm so um i'm so old school with that shit like i approach a woman like old school hey baby what's going on how you doing what's your name boom boom my name is betty boom 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 Nowadays, you can't even approach a woman like that because everything going on. You got Rona, you got social uh, distancing, you got motherfucking um, social media, you got money that fucked everything up, you got all this equality that fucked everything up where everybody thinks they're the same and being that everybody thinks they're the same and on the same playing field, they think they, men think they're women, men, women think they're men. It's really fucked up out here, bro. The only way they should have get back is if people go back to real human life. Real ways, the old ways, man. You know what I mean? But for y'all you nice guys, man, stop being so nice, man. Because what you think somebody ain't doing, they're doing. Because they think you're a pushover and you're going to allow this shit to happen. So stop being a fucking pussy, man. Please. And that goes for me and any other man out here. Don't be a pussy pushover, bro. You know what I mean? When you when you see something, call it out. Hey, hey. You ain't got to say hey, bitch, but hey, motherfucker. What? Well, hey, now. Fuck you got going on. Get your shit together. And they'll, they'll respect you for that in, at the end, man. Because if you're not supposed to be with somebody, you're not going to be with them. You can't force that. Don't worry about that. But don't ever goddamn try to make a shoe fit that don't fit. You understand what I'm saying? If you're a cornball, you might as well get with your corny ass lady. <laughs> if you're corny, get with somebody corny. If you're cool, you got more options. If you're pretty, you got more options. If you're handsome, you got more options. But don't go for the motherfucking uh, bad bitch bust down type that you think you want. Because you don't want it. I'm telling you, you don't want it. You might, you might need it, but you don't want it. That shit temporary, baby. Because an icon, an icon is for everybody, just like me. I'm in a position to where I'm doing this for everybody. An icon is for everybody. So if you were with an icon, a model, a porn star, a famous person, everybody trying to hit her, everybody trying to get her, man. Just be real with yourself, man. Wake up, smell the coffee, man. She big home, big belly, man. Nice guys finish last. Nice guys finish last. So, you know, I might get my laugh last, but nice guys finish last, man. Nigga, you got to be, bitch, what? And I'm not saying 
That's not what I'm saying. But those type of guys, they win. The type of guy, be, bitch, I, I, I told you, motherfucking that. They, he winning. He winning. He's winning. You feel me? Winning. And the nice guy's waiting. You understand what I'm saying? It's your big home, big belly, man. Like, comment, share, subscribe, man. I'm going to come back at you with some more, man. But women, y'all don't want no good, man. Y'all want to fuck, nigga. Y'all want to fuck, nigga. Punch you in the face. And fuck you, fuck you after. That's what the fuck you want. You know what I mean? It's your big home, big better, man. Much love and respect to y'all, man.